There it is, her lead singing, dude. I like when Pow sings. I don't know what the hell it is. Hey Nachos and welcome. Now, I have done quite a few songs, good handful of songs from The Warning, and, I, and I'm mesmerized by these girls. I think they're an absolutely uh, an amazing band. Probably one of the best female-fronted band, well, female bands in the entire world, rock bands. And I'm going to react to a song called Disciple, which was from the same concert that I have done a couple other songs from, the Tetro Metropolitan CDMX concert, which was uh, 2022. Um, so anyways, let's go ahead and uh, dip in. Wow. I like how the crowd's chanting before they even start. Heavy right out the gate. I like it. have to say this Danny has such freaking swagger dude that it oozes out of her glands you know what I'm saying she's super confident and I like that about her I love that about her I love it about the whole band don't get me wrong they all have this kind of swagger to them and god damn it they should all right let's shut up Oh, that was cool. I love when they do harmonies, but you actually got to see Pow actually like singing and doing the backups at the same time. A lot of times you see her doing her own singing, like the lead singing and stuff, but I, I, I dig seeing them doing harmonies. Very cool. Dude, they can rock the fluck out, man. Like, they just rock and roll, bro. I really dig their freaking style. So tight. There it is, her lead singing, dude. I like when Pow sings. I don't know what the hell it is. Why? Okay, I'm going to go back so I don't miss anything because I know I talk a lot and that's good. I need to talk, damn it, because I need to say that Pow and Danny have such u different voices, but they blend so well together. And when they sing separately, it matches the music perfectly, each on their own. And not only together, but just on their own, they're amazing and their voices hit. I like Powell's voice, so it's got a little bit of a kind of a raspiness to it, but not too much. It still cuts very clear. Dude, love it. Nice fill. Cool. 
want to hear that again. That was cool, and it broke down like that. And Powell's just singing. Swimming with the fishes till they drown. Swimming with the fishes till they drown. Very cool. Dude, I don't care what anybody says. They all have confidence and swagger, right? But tell me right now in the comments, if you want, doesn't Danny have like the most swagger out of all of them? There's something awesome about her. I don't know what it is. I mean, that right there, dude. I like this build up. I like Dude, I like how Paul got super excited there and she like kind of bounced on her chair right before it broke into the song, back into the song again. <laughs> That's so cool, dude. Is that the end of the song? That's a different way to end the song. That it, it, wow. It almost feels like there was more coming, and then all of a sudden it's like, oh, done. Another cool song from The Warning. Yes, I really dug this Disciple song a lot. And I do think that out of the, all of them, the handful of songs, like I said, that I've done, somebody was saying in the comments that there's um, a version of their Enter Sandman that they did that I watched the official video, right, with Alyssa, whatever her name was, and that there's a live version that The Warning did recently that's even better, just them live. So I'm going to have to check that out. I'll do that one of these days. And anyways, if you like my stuff, hit subscribe. Put some comments down below and tell me what you think and what you want to hear me react to next. And we'll talk to you later.